What's good, YouTube? Today, I want to discuss the two new Zodiac monsters coming out of Maximum Crisis and something that a lot of people are not considering moving forward. Billy came back from the LA Regionals, and I was explaining how Hammer Kong actually decided our Zodiac Duelist Tournament Finals and Top 4 in a really strange way that I personally didn't expect. And he's like, man, everybody at the LA Regionals was just telling me that it's another thing you overlay on and don't worry about its effect. It doesn't really need its effect. And I knew I should have read that card more so what zodiac hammer kong does is really cool especially for the zoo mirrors which you'll still be seeing a lot of in the upcoming format he overlays on any zoo like most zoos do and gains the attack and defense of everything under it but while this card has an xyz material your opponent cannot target face up zodiac monsters on the field with card effects any card effect except for this card once per turn, during the end phase, detach one Xyz material from this card. Now, Zodiac Chaconine has a really cool clause on her that she negates whatever card she brings back until the end of the turn. So, Hammer Kong is not going to have to detach a material if you bring it back with her. Now, how do we get the material on it? Ah, there's a convenient Zodiac that you can overlay on top of Chaconine to attach the material to him. Then, you can just overlay a Dryden on the Chaconine. And guess what this means? Your opponent can no longer force your Dryden with the threat of a Dryden during the rest of their turn. This means you're pretty much free to use your Dryden at your leisure in order to take care of your opponent's plays in the Zodiac Mirror while giving Hammer Kong his ability for the rest of the next of the turn. This is pretty awesome for the mirror match and a play that you guys should know. I know a lot of people are using Zodiac Chaconine in their fusion sub combos very early, but this play came up multiple times throughout the rest of the tournament. And Chaconine only takes two or more level four monsters. So she's actually very generic and you can make this extension play using instant fusion and have a rank 4 after doing your entire fusion sub combo in order to do this play. Isn't that pretty cool? So I just wanted to bring this up to everybody's attention like, hey guys, Hammer Kong is not just an Xyz material and he's going to have very intricate play moving forward. Stay woke people! This has been House of Champs, just doing a tech review here on what cards you're already probably going to be playing if you're playing Zodiacs.